Oh, where you watch? Look where you watch. No, where you watch? Choose the right thing to watch. And this enough to watch. Sticky Stucky Sweet TV with Keith Gargan, Facebook and YouTube. And that enough to watch. The movie star flight take off from Pelper Time TV. So that. Boom. A big sound of a big tune. Ja all is Emmanuel I woe Ja Gideon I'm a Gideon The Gideon I'm a Gideon The Gideon I'm a Gideon Well, Gideon go bustin' out the mat Again, so much oppression Poor people face right now Them crying out for freedom Them crying out for free speech Then, said them want to stand up Like them black liberators Like Malcolm X and Martin Luther And the ancient monarchy Where come pay of the way, sir Free up black people from me Tear down them fence, yeah Gideon, I'm a Gideon The Gideon, I'm a Gideon the Gideon, I'm a Gideon, well The Gideon go bustin' out the mat I listen, I see, I, the power of the Trinity Give us the teaching of His Majesty And we know war, not every... Blue, Mr. Gargan, blue Blue till me dance up me toe This is Sticky Stucky Sweet TV with Keith Gargan. Good, healthy food with the X Factor. So give it a like, share, subscribe, and touch up that notification bell. And that is it. Look at that. You wanna talk the facts, a pecan. And if you can't see a pecan, no, but you're not gonna see it anyway. You know what you're not gonna see. You can't go and chat and watching people. When my, when my pick up my tongue, I don't fucking know. To me, is one country. One nation, one people, and a God. So, if I am right, this does sound like the man who is two years ago in what we did at the press conference again. There is no other sovereign nation in this country. Deliver me from my enemy, my God. Set me an eye from those who rise up against me. Deliver me from the workers of iniquity. Save me from the bloodthirsty men. For the only lion wait for my soul. The mighty gather themselves together against me. Not for my disobedience. Not for my sin, Lord. I have done no wrong, yet they are ready to attack me. Rise up, behold, and help me. You, Lord God of armor, the God of Israel, rose yourself to punish the nation. Show no mercy to the wicked. Traitor sealer. They return at evening, holy light like dogs, and prowl around the city. Behold, they spot with their mouth, so they're in their lips, for they say, Who art us? But you, Lord, laugh at them, you scoff of all the nation. O oh, my strength, I wish for you, for God is my eye tower. My God will go before me with his loving kindness. God will let me look at my enemy in triumph. Don't kill them, or my people may forget. Scatter them by their power and bring them down, Lord, our shield. For the sin of their mouth and the words of their lips, let they be catching their pride. For the causes and lies which they utter, consume them in wrath, consume them, and they will be no more. Let them know that God rules in Jacob to the ends of the earth. Sila, at evening let them return, let them owl like a dog and go around the city. They shall wander up and down for food and wait all night if they ain't satisfied. But I will sing of your strength, yes I will sing a load of your loving kindness in the morning, for you have been my eye tower, a refuge in the day of my distress. To you my strength, I will sing praises, for God is my eye tower, the God of my mercy, Sila. Up and running, up and gunning, up, up, up. Sticky Stucky Sweet TV, Keith Gargan, Cassava, Passava, Man Over Matter, up and running. Anyway, right about now, we have two videos to really analyze. Got two videos we are analyzing now. So it's Vegas against the truth of the Partner Draw TV, analyze, and also Sticky Stucky Sweet TV. Yeah, man. So we are analyzing the truth and fiction with these people, we call themselves labor right, are labor right minded people. And sometimes when you come out with some bullshit, we just bore some wall, drill some wall, and laugh after them. Yeah, and that we are doing. So we're not gonna really, you know, no long, long talking, because the video is well compact already, you know. So we're not gonna really hang about and idle about. 
We're just going to go right into the thing, right? So, Vegas come out. I don't know why he keep on embarrassing himself like this, but it seems to me like he don't know what shame is. And then again, you can't blame nobody for that because of the labor right them still. Even in the heart of the government, in a the parliament, they're not ashamed. Them shame bag gone. So you see, it's not strange. It's not really strange to me. So him come out now, Vegas, Gagas come out now, and hear him argument when him come with now. Out a little bit. And and and, and the fool fool. There's nothing you can't pick from it. You have a sorry, is a big man who talk like this. And then, you know, we're gonna play. A real, real dieted labor right when the man talk it, you can't see that. And the man see the truth now. Well, I don't see him alone, you know, but a lot of them were, 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 were draw away. Now, now I come out publicly. But him, a part of the man will come out public, and him, the man, people will follow him. So we are put, you will hear your film argument, and you hear your Vegas argument, right? So we'll see the difference. So, anyway, so here goes. Boom. Heal up, heal up, heal up, brothers and sisters. Big up on yourself. All Jamaicans, whether you are Labour right, whether you are PMP. Big up on yourself. Now I want to do an analysis of the Jamaica Labour Party's conference, annual conference, that, um, that was yesterday, November 24th, 2024. But before I speak about that, I want to point out something quickly. I'm going to do a video about it, but I just want to tease it. The Integrity Commission has now exposed itself as a full PNP arm, in my opinion, based on what I've been seeing. The Integrity Commission released are gazetted, mean published, Mark Golding's statutory declaration yesterday, simultaneously with the Jamaica Labour Party annual conference on a Sunday. May I got talk more about it, but I just want to know if you still think that this is not a conflict of interest, if this is not partisan. If this is not the highest level of corruption. If this is not an attack on our Prime Minister. This is too blatant. And people who are saying Andrew Wilness must not stand up to them and take it to the court or to the courts. You are wrong. Now let's talk about the Jamaica Labour Party conference. I learned so much yesterday, I heard so much, it is difficult to condense all the information, condense all the information into, into this little video. But I heard so much, so much substance, no bugger antics, no bugger optics, no bugger unnecessary garbage semantics. Business as usual. That is what you got from the Jamaica Labour Party conference yesterday. You see a clear cut, a clear difference with how the Jamaica Labour Party conduct. Members conduct themselves compared to the PMP members. Lie or tell. No bugger antics, no bugger this. Boy, I don't know which conference I listen to. But all me hear is a bugger lie, bugger racism, racism, bugger um, finger moving, cutting short, tunnelies thing. All kind of bugger wrong and pure lies. So, yes, you know, you know, you're not here, you're substantive here. I don't know how you, boy, I don't know, you know, you know what? <laughs> right here. <laughs> no, no, you know, we have a laugh, is Look, 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 when I, Vegas, please, take a good look for yourself, you know. Yeah, take a good look for yourself, man. 
You sit down before a mirror and look for yourself. And look for yourself you're about um, just like you meditate and look for yourself. You're alone, you know. And meditate and look for yourself and, and see the road where you go along, you know. Believe you me. Yo, yo, yo. Just even look at their dressing, their attire. The uniform, the shirt, them, me are gonna need my shirt, chaps. Bro, God, me are gonna need my shirt. Small. Me are gonna need an extra small and a small for me and mix. The, the, the Jamaica Labour Party clothes just neat upon them. You can see, say, whosoever I deal with wardrobe, you can see, say, them put them energy into it and this is how you know who which administration is the right administration to lead jamaica the pmp them look back upon the videos them just look chaka chaka and it starts with the leader them look like they left from a rumbar at the pmp conference they looked like they left from a rum bar to the conference. That is what you get with PMP. I saw them deal with the economy. The Jamaica Labour Party iron it out. PMP crush it up. That is what you get from PMP. Chaka chaka. Crush up, crush up business attire. Even Dr. Tufton and Andrew Holness and Juliet them and, 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 and all the ladies, they just look clean. Hold on, hold on, Dr. Vegas, hold on. We say PMP look chaka chaka and look like they might come from the rum bar, particular Mark Golden. <laughs> no, sir, you are tired. Uh. All right, I will show you who look junk. And oh, chaka chaka, just watch this. Yeah, man. You said the leader look like him, I come from the rum bar and look chaka chaka. And you tab of PMP, look chaka chaka. I'm going to show you, look chaka chaka. I'm going to show you who junk and look like him, I come from the rum bar. You never see Mark Golden in a disc position yet. You fool, you fuck. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> Some of the PMP them no disrespect at the conference. They look like they left the rum bar, never go home, got beard, and just come so. And through the leader, no in a no shape as a leader, we're supposed to be. Well, you know, decent in him attire and in physique, him just look like a rumed British rumed. Whole leap of substance come out of the conference. We don't have time to go over all of them, but three of them stood out. But before me even read that, I want to read this quick to you. And I'm going to show you the reason why Jamaicans always go back to PMP and end up feel the wrath and the inept policies and behavior and economic disaster when they bring forward. Zin? No. Me see over the over the over the, the gleaner. Because the gleaner cultivate illiteracy. Illiterate people, it cultivate them. See? Hold on, hold on again, Dirty Vegas. You yeah, bash the gleaner now, wanna talk about it, cultivate shit, cultivate crop, and we call it, um, you know. Well, you try to accuse a, glee, a, a, a newspaper where we know, we grow up on, and things like that. So well then them compromise or 
them is a part of the PNP. Bullshit, not no go so. But if you go say that and I talk out like this now and I even draft your respectable big lady I talk talk her mind and I talk the truth. And you have yet you have people who are there say them we sell them house and sleep on the road. For give Andrew Wellness the money for make him stay in the power. You don't see that. But you see a distant big woman, a short woman picture. God don't want to talk for your right. A big woman, you know, respect and you, you because I don't have the same nasty mind. Just like Juliet Cockmouth, she come up and watch her come talk. The leader not say nothing. And you hear you come now. I come about the cleaner and this. So tell me something. What about the nationwide? What they cultivate? And what what, what they really promote? Oh, no, no, you don't see that. You piece of shit. And them say, you. A guy like you will shoot with shit. Me tell you all the while, you know. So me now pet you around here, pussy. Right? But we ever go and listen to you still. Cause you don't make no fucking sense. Let me tell you that. Straight up. Yeah? Yeah, man. Me see a lady made a comment. She said, oh my God. Jamaicans are going for this bait. People who pay their light bills monthly. What happens to them? Maybe everyone have to start thieving water and electricity to be recognized. This is so crazy. PM continued with his trick and who he can fool all the time and she put shame in her upper case. Now why am I showing you this now? I want to show you her picture. This is her picture. Because she said publicly, so we want to show her picture. No disrespect to her picture. And do not disrespect her or um, um, her, her. Yeah. But why me show her picture? This is supposed to be a pensioner, you know. This lady is supposed to be a pensioner. This is a big old woman. And some of them old people, yeah, them always make the PMP come back in a power. We need some grandchildren and some children to start sit with Uno grandmother and grandfather. It's a brother. This brother, 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 I'm really fucking mad. Let's watch him pick up the pussy here them off him tongue when I talk. It had this. Look at the man gone to now. You look what you want him gone to now. This woman is a big woman. Right? Big, respectful woman. I tell the truth. Because she knows the truth when she sees it. Because she knows a pure lie, the man I tell. And she can't see that, and him can't see that. Right? And I disrespect the woman. Because the woman have a right to talk. But even you show the picture, there is nothing wrong with you. Because you can't stand one for show your picture. But that is so disrespectful. A big woman who have experience, and I can talk about pension, I put up, put um. This guy that talks some rubbish, and me can't understand, you know. But we are talking just bullshit, brother. Right? Bullshit. You want to talk the facts, a peer can. And if you can't see a peer can, no, but you're not going to see it anyway. You know what you're not going to see. You can't go and chat and watching people. When I, when I pick off my tongue, I don't fucking know. This little rascal that you see there. Because every time young people are trying to move the country forward, the older generation, they keep holding us back. They hold you back in a religion, they hold you back in a indoctrination, they hold you back in a slavery, they hold you back in a everything. Because their mindset one way. PMP from birth, die-hearted PMP, labor right from birth, die-hearted labor right. Now lady, you were supposed to be a pensioner, you know, see the significance with what the Prime Minister talked about yesterday. If you're a pensioner, now you are paying. You see? You, no, now you are eligible to get your water bill where you owe for more than two years. Wipe away clean. Pensioners and people on the PATH program, meaning poor people, the people them way at all about every Jamaican forget the same thing. One minute you no know, complain, you no know, complain say the macroeconomic hunger benefit the, the, the working class or the upper class or the middle class. Then you know, say, no, say it will be it for everybody. 
The man can't put it for everybody because we need money for still run the country and, and fix roads and fix school and fix hospital. So he must cut yourself so, and cut this so, and cut little this so, and so it run. So pensioners will have them water bill wipe clean dash way if them owe that for two years or more and there's an amnesty for if you owe for six months or more yeah and that starts january in march after the budget is read the government will cut your light bill tax in a more than half from 15 percent to 7 percent that are for every Jamaican. Yeah, that's why I'm not sure I'm sure you said the woman is so bigger than you and big woman could not go to be your granny. I mean, I know what you is or whatever. But whatever is a big woman. But she know and very, very educated more than you because she knows so well then we are talking about get your, your water bill wiped clean. <laughs> you know, see, I can't and jewels, I can't do. Nothing like that. Nobody now go benefit more than a couple, five hundred dollars at most. So, this is a man who comes from Canada all the while, and you come and pick it up and nothing not go so. But I don't know why I'm doing this, brother, yeah? So the woman is so smart, I know so well then, because if she didn't know, so she would get that and get really, with six months water bill, you'll get wiped clean. My brother, well, you make her call him my brother anyway, but brother, let me tell you something. Cut the bullshit, because the woman is smarter than you and wiser than you. But you have to come out, come talk them crap here anyway, because you're on the peer, you're on the peer fucking list or something. You must get in some benefit to come out and defend the undefendable. That's all I can say. But the woman is wise, wise, wise. So when she come out and says it's a con, it's a con. So you call her a big old woman, but she have more sense than you. You should be ashamed of your damn God self. Mona come and rub up your mouth like this. Yeah, man. So we are going to go and listen to you the same way. Every Jamaican will go get them light bill chop, taxes chop in a two. You no still have a problem with that? Then if you don't want the redu with the reduced taxes, when you go to JPS, tell them you don't want it. But a lot of us glad for the little 8% deduction. Another thing we want to point out is the school. The school policies. The, 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 the education policies. Where the PM say? Social workers are going to start showing up at your homes. And they are going to ask you why your child not in school. And we are going to fix the problem. If a lunch money you don't have, if a bus fee you don't have, we are going to fix the problem. And how these problems will be fixed? Lunch programs. Transportation programs. You're going to get, if you are, 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 are a student who cannot afford to take um, um, transportation, private transportation, you know, your mother, your father, and a job at school, there are going to be buses where the government put money upon a card. And you use your card, and when you go in at the bus, you swipe your card like a, like a foreign style, like the train style. Swipe your card and go to school. So nobody no have no excuse to have them pit near them yard. Sit down lap foot and I watch people playing Twitter and I watch people on Instagram and I watch people on TikTok. Stop bite off on your nose to please on your face. Start sitting down with grandma and explain to grandma, say, Grandma, you're a pensioner. There are a lot of benefits for you and poor people who are on PATH, the PATH program. And the government is also putting out measures so that people who are not registered can be registered. Those, them things that we are called substance, this is not body come where the media all day now are going to talk about who showed up and who never showed up and which celebrity and who will compare with nobody where they show up. Stop biting off on the nose to please on the face and the Gleaner platform is a hub for illiteracy 
and I'm calling on the people out on the Gleaner platform, looking at yourself when you come for Rick, Jamaica. Boy, Mr. Andrew Wallace, me lose half of you to blood class a conference, man. You make the whole of you look like a blood clot fool. Come to think of it, you know. I think this man has sell the blood clot election to market, you know. Me I tell you, a million zim I get to sell out to the blood clot. Guys, I look to sell out, man, you know. You're going back to a conference again with the light bomb clot. Advance on people when you tell the people them that two years already, man. And you are fuck up the party, you know, Mr. Andrew Wallace. Right now, me I tell you, you make me feel shame. As a big labor rights supporter, you make me feel shame. And you know, say, me are no bias, man, when me a blood clot talk, and me not put my mouth on and talk when me a talk. You gone back again, gone fool the people, and I tell them about light blood class scam, when you tell them it's already. They you know, expect the people that you know, them bumbo clotted, you, you know, nothing else to tell the people. No, you are going to talk about you take a GTC after that because Canada do the same blood clot thing, you try to follow Canadian blood. I think you are follow. Yeah? Boy, I don't know what's wrong with you, bro, God, but I know Mrs. say you sell out the country, brother. I sell you, I sell out the country, you know, build the country, you know, I'm not busy what you want to say. Because you're going back with the same bumbo clot lie again, going to tell the people, like, you know, expect the people, they member. So you tell them that blood clot two times, this is the third time now you tell them about your, your dismantle light and you win, you know, dismantle light. You come again, you know, dismantle light and you use, but the same something again. Man, come down, man. Come down, bro, God, come down. Sorry to say, come down, man. Yeah, man. Come down, brother. Open your truck. So, Mr. Vegas and Mr. Gigas, your argument and your thing you're coming and talk about, you're going to analyze something. Your thing is anti lies. You come with real anti lies because you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. So, I'm going to give you real analyze now, right? With partner draw Andrew Steven, because same thing when I talk, and the same thing, me see. Mickey Ambos put it and give a man him credit. How him put it, I don't need to really um, put it now. I have to just play where him put it. Cause believe you me, he bore some more night and drill some more night. And that are the real analyze what him do. And that are facts. Everything this brother say are the facts. But you know how pick up on them things there. Eh? You come with anti lies, both analyze and come with a lot of bullshit. Yeah, man. Andrew Steven. Partner draw TV. Because I me, me, me think about the same thing we do a video, you know. And all we matter about, well, not everything, but most of the things we matter about, me see it, you know. The lies them. And the maroon, me see that. But him got deeper than me with the flag and things like that. And a lot of shit. And the old rascal, grandy them, when I get no respect, get paid disrespect. A lot of things. This is man that born a things and a drill wall. Because what I do, him drill the wall them deeper than me. So him go deeper than me. And him bore the wall them deeper than me. So, me just uh, go make him talk. Because that's the best thing. Because him put it the way, how it's supposed to be. And this is the argument, Vegas. What you have to listen. No facts in your reasoning. Your reasoning is just light. Like cock. You know, you know them cock, um, light cock, paper cock. I saw your argument stay. You just try to, you know, you don't talk nothing, you just call it a bullshit. So we're going to listen to some real analyze. Now, when somebody analyze something and really come out and bore the whole them, drill the whole them, and put the things them in a context, and people can understand and can see him talk, and you can see what him talking is what going on. So, Vegas. That is it. You don't have no argument, brother. Your argument is lean, little bit, just like you. Because you know I tell the things them what you're supposed to talk. Bag of rubbish. Just a bag of rubbish. That's why I say you always get people telling you to lift up all the while of a platform. Jenkins usher you out, fling you out like you're nobody. And you still are, you still come around and embarrass yourself. Look at that. Go write some tune, man. Anyway, we're not gonna waste the time on this because partner draw analyze the things and anybody with some sense will see that are the facts. In burn the fire real. And them deserve it because it's the truth. But what you are talking about Vegas is crap. But the cleaner is a compromise. Who compromise like the Jamaica Liberal Party? Who compromise like 
nationwide. So now like Dutch labor rights there and talk about um, free free freebies like school bus, lunch money. Nine years in power, I know when I come with them like a goodies. When tell people feel that, what happened to the storm with blow that day and blow them people are getting money yet? You know what? Uh, anyway, I jump right in an Andrew Stephen video now. So here goes. Boom. Partner Joe Andrew Stephen talk it as it is. And you can't go around that. You might not like him or whatever. And as me said before, I care zero about somebody sexual preference you know, not to do with me because once me know, you know me, so sometimes i don't know why people think so well and um we are living in a world right now where personally when somebody i tell the truth and i really make sense my life for really um that my life for really listen to and put my two my put my two cents to it and that me i do right i know because him come and him burn the fire real wicked and then deserve it. Because he bore the wall, drill the wall, and show up Andrew Wallace and his party where they make out there. And you come and come chat fuck like you think people don't have eyes and ears like you. You come put out something, come talk about something where um, integrity commission is um, corrupting. And <laughs> well, because, because the man them tell the truth. Them do something legal, you know, and legal thing them do, you know. To put out something, you know, because you state, state me, because that declaration. So if, if it's right, anybody, you have the, so the PMP minister, they come out of that, where they come out and say, well, then he wasn't like in a trouble. And the man clear up his name and, and blah, blah, thing like that. But he never, nothing like what Andrew Wallace do. So we are talking about the people, them, um, bias, are them that part of the PMP. And they, they, they fire from all angles. Whether you are PMP or GLP, but you don't go on the narrow side. Well, we're, we're too much on right now. Anyway, we get into this um, real analyze video where man are really analyze and a bore will not think. Yeah? So here goes. Boom. Didn't you see what they do at the conference today? Where them claims say a compound. Maroons in the building. Hey, hey! Hallelujah. Jamaica. On a ear. Remember, this is the same man. We say what they are. There's no other sovereign state apart from the sovereignty of Jamaica and this and that and reality. So then take up some. I want to give context because. I'm an associate of the context boss. So I have to give context tonight, Jamaica. You take up four people who say they are maroons, and then you say they represent the state of their compound maroons. I want to ask a question. Are any member of are any of these people who came today to say? That standing up as a compound maroons. Are they any part of the maroon council of their compound? Because this to me look like a carbon copy. Because the man with them say come as a compound was a farmer chief. And I want to ask you something in government. We want to ask you can you say we over here we analytical. If you're a past government member or a past president or anything, do you represent the present government? Do you represent the present leadership of that group? You remember when the money did miss in the accompany, you see that big fat one right there, so that one. When the money did miss in the accompany, the how much millions of dollars. This was the man behind it. Hey. So when you out a government and when you out a something, the past is the past. But I found it very strange today, Jamaica, that this said government that has been apathetic, this said government that has been very strong 
song to Chief Richard Curry was on the stage today. P producer, play what this man said about the Maroons today, now please. Play a word. I said to you, the people of the Maroons, particularly the Akonkong Maroons, that the government has a strategy and a plan and wants to work with you in building up your community so that you can take advantage of the heritage assets that you have and build your local economy. And that is how the Jamaica Labour Party pastor. We don't believe in separating ourselves. We don't believe in splitting up the nation. Jamaica is one country, one nation, one people, and a God. Out of <laughs> This does sound like the man who is two years ago in what we did at the press conference again. There is no other sovereign nation in this country. All of a sudden, the man changed him argument and changed him to one. I wonder if anybody can find that document, that, that video for me and send it to me. You remember when he was talking about the Maroons during the COVID period when the journalist asked him? And so my question is, why didn't he bring up the other maroon territories obviously the compound maroons is of great interest to this no 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 no. the compound maroon is of great interest to all political sides but the pnp had the right maroon no sir the pnp had the chief the pnp had the chief they are PNP, they are the ambassador. The, something is, there must be something why everybody wants to be associated with the Maroons. But why did they have to dig up the old time one? Them? Why couldn't they invite Chief Richard Curry? Why couldn't they invite Chief Richard Curry? Oh, I know why. I remember there is a what oh no, 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 this is about me. I got tax on my maroon business tonight. Me attack it, they call me. Me attack it, like, oh, no, no. There is one only for money where Bob's in need for claim at the United Nation. Lord Jesus, oh, no, why me open my mouth tonight? Oh, no, why me open my mouth tonight? What a bangarang! There is a holy yeah, yeah, when play about the play about the vice, play about the something that make me die second phone or jump. I can't know the teacher know the things there. I said to you, the people of the Maroons, particularly the Akonkong Maroons, that the government has a strategy and a plan and wants to work with you in building up your community so that you can take advantage of the heritage assets that you have and build your local economy and that is how the Jamaica Labour Party pastor. We don't believe in separating ourselves. We don't believe in splitting up the nation. Jamaica is one country, one nation, one people and a God. Out of the <laughs> You heard it, Jamaica. He said there is something called heritage assets. He said it, a lot of you might not hear it, but he said it, there is something, the heritage assets. So why wasn't he speaking about the heritage assets? Yes, the heritage assets existed from then. The Maroon people have not been getting the resources that they should be getting through the government. The government knows that they have to make a representation to the United Nations to get certain resources. So what Babsy do today, Babsy fine. 
some makeshift maroon because she need to get the money at a particular time. Uno think I like me at all? Uno think I like me? Uno go call Chief Richard Curry. Go call the ambassador for the maroon and ask me if I like me at all. There is a whole heap of money. See what Chief Curry say? Desperate JLP propaganda. Every member of them a compound town is home cooking Sunday dinner and watching. Watching what the chief say? Watch what the chief say? Watch. <laughs> Let me read again because me look like me need glasses. Desperate JLP propaganda in laugh out loud. Every member of their compound is home cooking Sunday dinner and watching this sir. So which circus did I keep? The circus. I would circus in a key. This the circus than the arena, the circus than a sure. The sure's brother then. Mm. <laughs> yes, but I am telling you, Jamaica, you might not be aware. What is a heritage asset? Let me go. I want you guys to go further because me a dissect it tonight, you know. Uno go research what is an heritage asset for me, no? A heritage asset is an item which has value because of its contribution to the nation, society, knowledge, and or culture. Such items are usually physical assets. But some countries also use the term in relation to tangible social and spiritual inheritance. Didn't I tell you there is something in the compound that this man wants? And I tell him, same thing good on there. So when do him do make shifts and find fake carbon copy maroon and tell carbon copy maroon to come sit down, put up arms, as a matter of fact, you, this set of maroon couldn't even use the maroon flag. There is a particular accompanying maroon flag. Why couldn't it have been used? Why couldn't that maroon flag be used? Because it's a part of the playbook. Bogus, bogus playbook play out to the Jamaica. Bogus play out, play, play book, play out today. And when I talk, people are saying, boy. So if they are that low and desperate to go and find people to create stories, to brand them, to say that they are representation, imagine how low they will go. It's bogus carbon copy maroon. Them fine for come come give accreditation today, you know. And people are wondering, what else did they do? My God. So I don't see who is the boogeyman. I don't see now who is the bogus man. So the Akumbang Maroons aligned to the People's National Party and said they are willing to work with the People's National Party. But here comes such man, Master 28, Mr. Bogus, Carbon Copy, finding four people. It is not even a quorum, you know. How much next a quorum? You need six or more people to make a quorum. It was four people. It was four people. How many people vote in their compounds election? Almost 6,000 people. So if you do the maths and you do the, the semantics, not even a quorum of people represented the so-called maroons from their compound. Mash down that lie, Jamaica. Mm -hmm. Mash down that lie. But let us count. I am boring. Hey, hey. If I'm boring, what you're doing over here, Bunununus? If I'm boring, what you're doing over here? If I am so boring, what you're doing over here? Mmm. Hi. <laughs> Make a continue tonight. Hey, mighty God. 
I hear another story where that 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 one that one where fear mouth full of frost and need that all. That one where full up her mouth full of frost and need that all. She she come a talk about Mark Golding disrespect black dreaming. Where did Mark Gold? You see, Mark Golding, you according to you, Mark Golding this play our speech that tough that tough one i did i, I did want to fix her from from friday you know but god give me the opportunity to fix her now listen to the foolishness what she shot today Jim. listen to the our leader is strong our leader is active our leader is about serving your interests but there's another man called marky british and he is a man who believes in holding chains around the neck of black people. And in a missesso, I hear my take picture, a whole chain around my neck, the rest of my neck. We have to say no to Marky British because he's a man who loves to show off, him love to boast, and say him done rich already. We don't need a man like that. We have to say no to the man that is leading the PNP who love to style black people and call them little boy and little lady. We have to say no to the man who tell us out of his own mouth that him want to run Jamaica with himself and him top and our his friend them. We have to say no to the PMP Tapanaris man and him friend Peter Bunton, who's really the leader. Because they are the same ones who had a company years ago that benefited, benefited from the wicked PMP policies and they made millions off the backs of the Jamaican people. Some of them suffered brutally they even committed suicide and we have to say no to them we have to say no to the pmp tapanaris men who comp whose company was investigated for anti-corruption we have to say no to them because we know that we have the better leader um Una call that the data that one you will need detail in I am out no please. Me have un, me can mix detail with GS. Me can mix detail with with GS Jamaica. And me need detail GS. I me need one hundred percent bleach for the lady mount. Come here, come here you, come here Tuffy. Come here, come here, come here, come here you girl. Me na me na be misogynistic and. Tyler, you know. But come here, me go mix the detail with the jays and the bleach. And me go put a little garlic and turmeric in the back. And me have to go give some of the things them for us. And me can't put a little bacon in there for the insect. Me need a little insecticide and castic soda. Because when me done, throw it down in our throat, it must purge her and clean her out. Yes, me love. You come here. When I don't purge and clean, you know, you know. I bet you don't talk them foolishness here. When you talk about better leader, and I go and need a plunger because you clog up. You clog up. She clog up Jamaica. Me quick get the plunger if you plunge it. Mm -mm. So now, Jamaica, I want to ask you a question. She talk about better leader, but let us give context. When Big Stone was on stage with Mark Golding, Big Stone was doing a reflection and a replica of how Andrew Golding of the chain round my neck. And what Big Stone said, Mark Golding, free me, free me from the iniquity, free me from the wickedness of this government. But you never understand the context, beloved. 
So you, when you see the chain, you think about slavery, but it's talking about the political, systematic, corrupted, chronistic slavery that you and the next 48 of them have we under bandage in it. But you might not be aware when you talk about better leader. Do the same beat way. Can you confirm whether or not your leader has been certified by the integrity commission? Because I see today when I open the paper and look at the gazette, Marky G. Yes, Jamaica. The same Marky G where she they talk about. Yeah, the lady with the full up and the filter. So the lady where they talk about. Mark Golding, Mark Jefferson Golding, statutory declaration has been certified. People, 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 what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe to the Sticky Stocky Sweet TV channel. Keep Gargan up and running. Subscribe, like, and share. What do you waiting for? It's not going to cost you a cent. Just from your art, yeah. Man, sticky stocky TV. If your finger is not sticky, subscribe. But if your finger sticky, do not subscribe for sticky stocky TV. Big up yourself, King God straight. You never know. See there, Jamaica. Go and look into your papers. Go and look. And tell me now, when you talk about better leader, your man, your bugle gum, best baby father, 28 a cup, and we can't track the world. The man, they tell us, him look far and wide and no, but Mark Welling has never been under no such investigation. So when you talk about better, tell us no, better in terms of what? Integrity? What do you mean by better? Better in terms of what? Integrity. Because when you're talking about integrity, the man's argument is he don't have the money already no need for rap from poor people. How that a bossy? Because the whole you know why, why this lady wants to start me up in the night here, Jamaica. So when I hear this filthy hog mouth on a platform talking about better leader and Mark Rowling is disrespecting black Jamaicans. Why should don't talk about she disrespecting her thousands of representatives and uh, 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 um, people in West Rural? When them call her phone and talking to her, she telling them the only for not a bad word. When she done, she hang up phone from them. When she done, she kiss her teeth. When she done, she walk away from them. When she done, she left the garbage at them yet. Why she don't talk about that Jamaica? Why she don't talk about that Jamaica? I am asking you tonight. Why she don't talk up? She cannot talk about that because the truth and in fact, when you look at the realities, who is the better leader? Answer me the question tonight. Who is the better leader? Because me beat Mark Gwelling, nuff, nuff, nuff. Who no know me beat him, nuff. But when him do good, me tell him no do him good. When him do bad, me tell him same do bad. Be honest, Jamaica, who is the better leader right now for this country? It can't be that way them a producer talk about third term, you know. It can't be that way them a say figure third term, you know, Jamaica. So when you're talking, darling, and you're doing a comparative analysis, when the evidence can't substantiate the argument, you know what it is called, Juliet Cuthbert Flint, a fallacious argument. And a fallacious argument comes in many different ways. What you had talking about was what you call a red herring in your argument. You know what is a red herring? Go back. Me not talk about the red herring where you near make your breath fratty, fratty and smell away. You know. Me not talk about red herring in the argument. Probably she not really not, you know, my love. I don't think she really know that because... She, when she runs, she comes second and left with a silver medal. <laughs> you know.
don't know about them argument, the darling. You really don't know about them argument, you know. So, I'm leaving you alone because we have much more figure deal with today. Did you see how the labor rights were behaving on the buses? Did you see the evidences of the labor rights on the buses this morning? Boy, it is mere vulgarity. Hmm? Silver Queen, I wonder if it play the play, play the please. Play the video of them are behaving at the bus student. Who are the little ones? Come on, watch it. Come on, screen the people. Come on, screen the people. Come on, screen the people. Come on, no, no, they're disgusting, so you would. Don't go like him as much. I'm buckled. Yo, yo, you say you would. I'm the worst, most disappointed fan, cuz. I swear to God, bro. All of them come out, all of them come out for one buck lot, money for one buck lot. I'm only going to come out from my side. 254 people. Who won got on? I'm only going to come out. You can have right there, so you can have a count on. You can have right there, so you can have a count on. Yeah. You can have a count on. Yeah. You can have a count on. No, 27. 27. 27. Yeah, you drive, I'm going to tell you. No, you see, all right, I'm sure on how it come young now. Listen, you see, mega, mega not deal with things calm neither. In a real life, I'll want my mother. He not deal with things calm neither. All him to do, I check time and blood clot to wind up. He go on like him to have his swear, you. That's why I'm not going to lock up my life, you know. On the top of his screen for me there. Top of his screen for me there, people. Top of his screen for me there, I watch it, I watch it, I watch it, this is where it's in my boss. Top of his screen there, people. Top of his screen there, people. Five thousand can't move. Five thousand can't move. How about we scream the people and enjoy? I enjoy. You see what I'm talking about? Help! 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 We can't get out of here. We need divine intervention. You see what I'm talking about, Jimmy? This is a really disgrace to know that on a Sunday morning, people wake up out of them bed for five thousand and three thousand dollars, behaving like hooligans. Five thousand and three thousand dollars, behaving like hooligans. And you ask me, what is JLP is in? That is the definition of labor rightism. Mm -hmm. That is the definition, Jamaica, of labor rightism. Hungry, desperate, and low. You hear? Them have the 27 envelope. And them are war in the 27 envelope. Desperate and low. Very desperate. Very, very, very low. But did you see, did you see the dispensation of Audley Shaw and Carl Samuda at the JLP conference? I don't think, I don't want nobody says lie telling on them, you know. Did you see the dispensation of Carl Samuda? Look at, my God, look at the elders of the Jamaica Labour Party. Look at the elders of the Jamaica Labour Party. But you know, Jamaica, as I analyze and criticize this conference, tell me if I am fear in my assessment. Carl Samuda and Mike, Carl Samuda, Audley Sean, Mike Henry would have done cumulatively about 120 years together in politics. And you're telling me if these men contributed this much to the political party that they are part of, 
you are at your last conference heading into a general election. The men are not going back for representation. You go tell me, say, I saw the Jamaica Labour Party vulgar. You go tell me, say, I saw the Jamaica Labour Party inconsiderate. At no point in the conference, you highlighted the work of Manaya. You highlighted the work of Carl Samuda. You highlighted the work of Mike Henry. At no interval did you give a tribute to these three men who cumulatively have represented your party for 120 years. What can go so? No, 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 no. Jamaica, think about it realistically. Served in an organization for 5, 10, 15 years, and when people are of retirement function, they're not honor you. What happened? People get vexed, don't it? And you're telling me that these men, Carl Samuda, tell me labor right, labor right, tell me for no disrespect that. You are telling me that the three men cumulatively who have guided Andrew Wallace, who assisted him to becoming prime minister in 2016, you are telling me, Jamaica, at no interval. Did you even do a little video tribute showing Adley Shaw from him days of a youth, showing Mike Henry from him days of a youth to where he is now, showing Carl Samuda from the days of a youth to where he is now? And you're telling me that that conference was a success and you never honored your past a people without their heritage what did mark what marcus garvey tell you about a people with no heritage when you don't honor your elders there is no way you can get honor so you don't respect the elders who have tried the path for you So can you imagine how those men feel this evening? Look at them face. Look at them face. Not even to say, all right, you're not doing the video, don't it? You couldn't buy three plaques and you will let me never ask. You couldn't buy three plaques and call them up and say, come here, man, yard. Come here, Mike Henry. Come here, Sal Carl Samuda. Tell me, Jamaica. It would take up three plaques. I said to the man, then big up and we're going to do something in a something. We're going to do a nice little reception, etc. etc. Guys, at the man, politics member saying, you know, guys, if me if 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 if, if me wrong, tell me say me wrong. But tell me now, guys, every year the people them go at them political conference. And at them band them last conference. And you're gonna tell me say, only never even look pan for ear of the man. This is what Derek Morgan talked about, you know. All epa passa passa. This in truth is definitely passa passa. Said so this woman no so no founder labor rights not like me. But listen to what me I said tonight and listen to the message and the messenger. Do you think that fear representation for the men who have tried the work that the, to where the party is now, I'm going to make it known. If he never did for if he never did for I could have understand. But Carl Samuda was one of them who stood with him in 2013 when Ardley said no want him as the leader, and Carl Samuda gave him all of his delegates. About it, Mike Henry in a 2015, me go, me say, Mr. Henry, work with Andrew. Uh, and me, uh, Mike Henry look and say, Andre, Andrew, Andrew Oldness is a serpent. And me say, Mr. Henry, in the interest of the party. And you know, Mike Henry work it out and say, I will be the campaign manager for Andrew Oldness. And you go tell me, say, and a man that makes you whisper you then now and not even honor him. Foxy, Hi, the house. We are the, the, the divine intervention. Yeah. With
tired of the labor right. So when I see them doing what them doing, me I go say to everybody around him, take sleep mark that if he could have do this to Carl Samuda, if he could have do this to Adley Sean, if he could have do this to Mike Henry, what he would do to you. <laughs> This is the No money, I got the man hundred dollars. The man said I saw fifty dollars. one one. One one. I'm win. All right, go on, go on. You go one one. Yeah. You win, don't. You go one one. Me lose one. I yeah. can win, lose, we have one up there, and the man we win one. now, free me free. And me take up this, okay, sorry, yeah. this how we take up from this. Let me know one up there, what's in the one yeah, there? It's okay, you're the man, brother, I'm going to win now. You're going like that. They're the one, they're the free me free, you know. I'm going to give him a this how I love you. And me, I'm going to have 50 dollars up there. No. You can't have 50 dollars, you're going to lose one. They know you mean, they're going to lose one and win. They know what's that one. When you do, we are not. when you win. Hey, me have one up there. <laughs> well, let me hear you. Let us, you lose one now. <laughs> no, if you lose one, you not two here. And to all this, let me tell you this. Laughing. Yo, let me tell you this. Bumbo wall. One, three point five. What? Three point. <laughs> Tell me, brother, man, Andrew Olness, morning, about six o'clock now, by, what time want it? By 6.15, one, five pint, <laughs> three pint five, three pint five million thousand dollar. I want it, no pussy. What time, six o'clock? Six o'clock, I want it, no. Pussy, <laughs> Batty boy. I mean, I'm a friend there. Yeah. Boom, dongy, boom, boom. <laughs> <laughs> a big sound, a play, big, big tune. Ja, all is Emmanuel. I woe. Ja, Gideon, I'm a Gideon. The Gideon, I'm a Gideon. The Gideon, I'm a Gideon. Well, Gideon go bossing out the mat again. So much oppression, poor people face right now. Them crying out for freedom. Them crying out for free speech. Then said them want to stand up like them black liberators, like Malcolm X and Martin Luther. And the ancient monarchy will come pave the way, sir. Free up black people from it, tear them them fence, yeah. Gideon, I'm a Gideon. The Gideon, I'm a Gideon. The Gideon, I'm a Gideon, well, the Gideon go bustin' out the mat. I listen, I see, I, the power of the Trinity, give us the teaching of his majesty, and we know war, no devil philosophy. Not ten trickle every from my skin is of no more significant, well, to the color of his eye. Remember all the war done in 1935. This is Sticky Stucky Sweet TV with Keith Gargan. Good healthy food with the X Factor. So give it a like, share, subscribe and touch up that notification bell. And that is it. Look at 